all seen it. Places everywhere going out of business because of high expenses and other unfortunate circumstances. But the owner of a Tiverton business was on the brink of closing and decided to ask for help. And the response, well, it was truly unexpected. Here's NBC 10 Sam Reed showing us something good. Right on the border of Fall River, Massachusetts in Tiverton, Rhode Island, Baja's Cat Cafe has been in business since 2021. It has been a roller coaster journey. Inside the shop is a room geared at caring for cats. They can come in and they can meet the cats from Forever Paws Animal Shelter, um, which we've been partnering with for the past three years. $8 gives you a half an hour of interacting with these furry friends, and all of them are up for adoption. We have helped probably about 500 cats by now. Owner Amanda Souza says besides helping find homes for hundreds of felines, once they're here, she's responsible for them. So if there's any medical expenses, food, water, the whole nine. So how does she keep up with all of it? It's supposed to be the cafe part, a Baja's cat cafe. I don't think people kind of understood that we're a cafe. You don't need a reservation to come in the cafe section. So when you come in and you purchase like a coffee or a tea, those proceeds go to help those cats. Despite keeping prices low, things on the cafe side have been slow. And a little more than a week ago, Sousa says she went into meltdown mode. And I'm thinking, oh my God, we're going to fail. We're going to have to close the doors. What can I do? How can I fix this? The panic started when not a single customer came into the cafe that day. We normally open at 7 a.m. and it was almost almost like 10, 15, 10, 30 and not one person had come in the, in the cafe. So Sousa took her frustrations to Facebook, putting pride aside to ask customers to please come in. That's the only thing I can do is I can ask my co community to support me and to support the cause because at the end of the day, you don't have to love me. But you have to be able to want to love those cats. From there, the post went viral and things took off. It was so crazy that the door handle fell off my door. <laughs> Hundreds of people flooded the cat cafe for days following, the most she's seen since opening. It was just beautiful. It was, I don't think in a million years I could have ever wished for something as, as amazing as that. Sousa hopes to eventually become a full-fledged rescue and says she would really appreciate the ongoing support. In 2023 alone, approximately 3.2 million cats were taken in by U.S. shelters. And if we can do something just to help our little community, um, it's going to make a big difference. Showing you something good. I'm Sam Reed. Take care.